This Algo Design Lab strategy enters an order into the market at a designated bid price. For executed orders, it then enters an automated hedge order at a profit price of one minimum price increment from your fill price. In ADL, the building blocks to create your strategy are located in the menu along the left side of the platform. In this join bid with a hedge strategy, the first step is to select an instrument. Drag an instrument block from the menu. Then select E-mini S&P 500 March 2010 ESH0. Continue building the strategy by selecting an instrument attribute block. From the drop down menu, select the bid price from available attributes. Now we need a market maker block. So drag and place one in the ADO worksheet. Now create the order quantity. Drag a constant value number block. Double click on this block and name it order quantity. Now right click on this block again and select user defined variable which will populate in the upper right side of the ADL screen. For this example we will use an order quantity of 10. Do the same for the instrument block as well and let's name it market. Creating user defined variables soft codes them so you will have easy access to change them when you run the strategy from the ADL cockpit. Now connect all these blocks together. First, connect the ESH0 instrument block to the bid price input as well as to the instrument input on the market maker block. Then connect the bid price output to the price input on the market maker block. Connect the order quantity block to the quantity input on the market maker block. Now create the hedge logic for this ADL strategy. Drag a market maker block and double click on it and select sell. Connect the ESH0 instrument block to the instrument input on the sell market maker block. Drag a value extractor block and then connect the fills output on the buy market maker block to the input on the value extractor block. Then double click on this block to set the value to be extracted. Select fill price and drag it onto the green canvas and click OK. This block now extracts the fill price information from any fill. Drag a value accumulator block and double click on this to set the variable to be accumulated. You can select fill quantity. Drag that into the green canvas and click OK. Connect the fills output on the buy market maker block to the input on the value accumulator block. This block now extracts the fill quantity variable from any partial fill the strategy generates. Now we want to set up our profit for our hedge logic. Drag an adder block and an instrument attribute block. From the instrument attribute block we want to select the minimum price increment which will output the minimum price increment for ESH0 to be used in the calculation of the profit for the hedge. Now we want to connect all of these to create the hedge logic for our strategy. Connect the ESH0 instrument block to the instrument minimum increment block. Then connect the output to the top input on the adder block. Connect the extractor output from the fill price block to the bottom of the adder block. This will now have an output value of the fill price of our partial fills plus one price increment. Then connect this output from the adder block to the price input on the sell market maker block. And lastly, connect the output from the value accumulator block, which is our fill quantity, and connect that to the quantity input on the sell market maker block. Now on the title block at the top of the canvas, type join bid hedge. And save this algo in the ADL strategies folder under join bid hedge. Now that we have created this join bid hedge algorithm, let's test it on the ticket sim environment to see if the logic of the algorithm works as expected. Go to the ticket launch pad and open the ADL cockpit. You will see your algo name in the upper left box, select it, and you will see that you can change your designated variables at this time. Click launch and you will see how the order shows up in the screen directly below. The algorithm is highlighted pink to denote an on the market algorithm. In the upper right box you will see all the orders involved in your algo in green. On the latter you will see a blue highlighted box on the bid side which shows the order and quantity and then a red box on the offer side when the hedge parameters are met. You can also have the fill screen open to monitor the fills for this order. 
The join bid hedge example we created here is only a basic starting point for utilizing the full set of capabilities within the Algo Design Lab. The user can also add in multiple other risk parameters and variables to custom fit their desired strategy. We could add multiple thresholds of quantity values to define when the algorithm will work the bid side order. Or we could add in logic to set a clip size to keep the program running after initiating trades are hedged. And the hedge routine can of course be designed to have flexibility beyond working one profitable offset level with routines such as OCOs against other markets or by including smart stop logic. These are only a few examples of the ways Algo Design Lab can help the user build custom strategies. The combination of ADL and the Ticket Sim environment provide the user with the capability to experiment with strategies and test effectiveness.